like in my bold prediction that I made in the last episode, there's going to be there's going to be dual screens on the um, Wave Twos for um, RK One Up for sure. Like they can't not do it. And I'd prefer one with with um, full back glass art with the um, the blockade marquees um, that we offer for free. You know, <laughs> for cabinet manufacturer. They will look much better, don't you think? Yeah. <laughs> Wait, with with our logo on the back glass. Oh well, no. What are you Just, talking you know, about? The, you know the um the all the different back glass art that you prepared. Oh, for the all back the different... glass art that I made. Yeah. Yes. We, you know, they they could have those. We we give them to them. Honestly, and, um, I'm sure that that Zen could come up with better back glass art than what I produce. Probably could. Yeah. Yeah. But you know, it's it's a starting point. It'd be. I, I like one. my back glass art, and I, th- I think they're great. Um, and we have we actually had pretty good feedback from um a uh a fully played up blockade member of which you don't have to pay a single cent for, by the way. Um, <laughs> and uh, they, they said it was really easy to like get that set up and, and actually those back glasses align correctly in the, the DMD into them. And it just looks much better. Let's see if I can, let's see if I can real quickly. Well, I'll, I'll throw a link into the bottom here. If you look right now, you'll see it um, yeah. for where you can pick up these, uh, these back glass, but let me see if I can just really They're quickly... also in the show notes. So if you go over to um, the uh, the website, there's always a permanent link in there to all the back glass art. Um, so Yeah, but I can actually, I have the capability, Jared, of actually showing everybody what these look like. Ooh. All right. So let me just uh, get into my, my Google Drive file where these are, and I will give a little demonstration of what some of these look like. So, here we go. That's over here. I'm going to share my display. All right. So, this is kind of what I did for aliens because I wasn't happy because I'm dealing with a uh, a 16 by 9 screen, but I wanted that 4 by 3 um, orientation. Orientation, yeah. Hmm. So I created. This is, a, this is how it should have been. Yeah. Like, so I created the the. the uh, I shouldn't say I created. I copy and pasted and found various parts. <laughs> I found that artwork that had the aliens with the pinball in its hand. And then I found the the grill, the speaker grill, and then I added in the Zen logo for you know that and and then you can drop your DMD over the top of that area. And I made sure that most all the DMDs are the same height. Um, but then, you know, we have things like, you know, doing it with American Dad. Um, and then for all the Zen originals I use this style, so it's a multitude of, of Pinball FX3 screens in the background with this particular style of uh, logo going on the front of the DMD. Uh, it's Archer Pinball. There you go, another Zen original of that nature. Piece of the deep. Yeah. Um, and then if I just pop out of here, give you an idea of... Uh, sure, we'll just go with... Black Rose. Um, so again, that's that's the actual back glass that Black mm. Rose has. Yeah, it's, I didn't alter anything on that. Um, that's the shape. That's the where the DMD was for it. Um, everything. So that's this is what we're talking about. That at games or Farsight should be putting on their monitor. You see the black edges there. It's on a 16 by nine screen. It's just letterboxed in. Uh, With the correct rate, like um, aspect ratio. Right. Um, and look, maybe there, there's a screen there in the flyover mode um, on the, um, the game's uh, photos that you showed that kind of suggests that that's what they've done with theirs. Right. But until we see it running, we can't be sure. So here's um, what this was. This was the screwy one. Because there was no uh, good way of doing Doctor Dude. Doctor um, Dude's hard because of the panel. <laughs> well, I mean, the Bally logo is all the way at the top. It's got this vertical screen. So unfortunately, the DMD just sits over the top of it. And also, there was no way of putting the uh, lenticular or the rotating dude display. That's what's yeah. in the black pit there. Um, and then, which well, they've managed to do for the record on uh, when you're actually looking in flyover mode. 
um, on the uh, the the back glass for Doctor Doom. They've actually done that. But look at um, how good would, would Fantastic Four look with that background. I like that background that I did on that. That's the, cool. With all the myriad of comic books and stuff. Yeah, I that's think that sweet. would be pretty awesome. And then I'll just show, just so people can see, what the Star Wars ones look like. Um, just put some hyperspace yeah. as the background and, and did a little See, like they look great. So, yeah, yeah we'll uh, I'll include the, uh, like I said, in the... the description down below this video on YouTube uh, where you can download the link for that and be able to uh, yeah. see so, we have them available uh, Wilbur's helped out he um, made 16 by 9 full display or no excuse me he did a dedicated 4 by 3 display so he chopped off all the black so it, if you have a 4 by 3 display it'll fit perfect go on straight those. in there mine are for 16 mm. by 9 um, but not stretched I didn't want any of the stretched I could find the uh, stretchy versions Yes, all over the place. But they they're no good. <laughs> I didn't <Yeah>. like them. <laughs> um, now they're all really good, and for people who like to use cabinet mode on Zen, um, they're a great way to just add that little bit of more realism into your build. Um, yeah, and, I haven't. You know, somebody uh, and I've had links to it. I haven't seen it in action myself. Uh, there's animated back glasses Ooh. that have been made. Um, I don't know exactly how to make those work <laughs> with with FX3, but I know that people have made them work. Um, I wonder if the cabinet mode in FX3, for those ones like Safecracker that actually have a live back glass, I wonder if the cabinet mode allows you to actually throw that image up onto a second screen and just have it work. Uh, it's something I haven't played with because I haven't got the cabinet mode set up. Um, but maybe they've actually enabled that now for for the um, the Williams well, collection. There's the other question. I don't know that these that the cabinet mode is anything more than uh, say a gift. Just the fixed view. of it, just showing blinking lights that aren't coordinated with the actual game itself, or right. if somehow it. I, it's, I mean, how would it pull that information? It doesn't have any access to your ROM. It's just an animated screen file. So yeah, I'm, I'm more talking for, about. I'm, so for Safecracker, no, it's not going to function like Safecracker should. I'm just more talking about has Zen actually coded that into their cabinet mode, oh. so you could th you could throw up the the second screen up there like that. Well, that's because my, I don't understand why Zen hasn't why they, yeah. that hasn't been made available. It 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 pains me. It would that take they them so do. so little extra effort for them to actually think about the back glass and throw that up as a second screen because the DMD is is separate. So they could just say that DMD as well as the back glass. Is well, not only that, screen. but it's been coded because all you have to do is give a flick up on your your right analog stick, yeah, and, and you can there. see the back glass, and it's fully animated to what you are doing at that very time. Correct. Yeah, it's fully synchronized with the play yeah. field. Like the, yeah, they. I don't know why they haven't done that. Hmm. V2. Why have we not complained to Mel about this? <laughs> We should totally complain to Mel about this because he's totally going to go, oh, these two guys said we should do it. So everyone, <laughs> drop everything and go and put that the, the back glasses on the cabinet mode that only 3% of users use. 